guys welcome back to my channel um, so this weekend I'm away with the family we rented a uh, little cottage between Dolgetlay and Barmouth in North Wales um, since we live in North Wales we're allowed to travel around Wales um, and rent self-contained um, accommodation so um, so we've got a little cottage for the weekend so today is Friday and we've just stopped in a forest called Coy de Brennan um, on the way down just for a little walk. Um, got a new bag as well, which I'm going to uh, test out over the weekend. This was um, a prize from a guy called uh, Tony, the Cockney camper. Um, and I entered a little competition on his channel um, to win this bag. And uh, yeah, I won it, he sent it to me and I'm gonna be testing it over the weekend. So we're in the, uh, we're in the van and uh, I'm just gonna chuck some stuff into the bag and uh, head off and try and find the old uh, copper mine. Okay, so this is the bag that I won off Tony. Thanks very much, Tony. It's, um, it looks great, I've not used it yet. It's uh, Pro Action, um, I've never heard of the brand. But it, it seems like a, a nice little bag to go on an adventure with. Um, as you can see, the, the van looks like a bomb's hit it. Bikes, all the stuff for the weekend. So that's going to get uh, taken out into the cottage. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to load this up and head on out. Wow. Right, should we head up here and find Mummy and then we'll try and get down to it? Great stuff. We're just heading down to find a copper mine. Cool. 
Ocean and the Texas Rock and Old Building. So what do you think that means? So like, the man's falling off a cliff. So that would be like, there's something there and it might be, it might be jagged and like a cliff and then you might fall off or Yeah, and then what's the other bit says, and old what? An old building, because if you might touch it, it might like collapse on you. There we are, so we have to be careful, don't we? Right, let's go and find this mine. Okay. So we've reached the top of a copper mine. I'll say the top tops up there so we're gonna head up now Glastier Copper Mine, the little mine with a worldwide impact. It's hard to believe that in the 1890s, in such a peaceful countryside setting, up to 200 men worked here mining copper. On the terraces below stood massive dirt, dirty factory buildings where workers operated heavy machinery, which crushed and ground the copper ore, the raw stone material dug from the ground. The industrial noise would have been deafening, with workers shouting at each other just to be heard. So we're uh, back at the van now, done the walk, um, which was, what's it say, 1.2k. So it's only a little circular walk. Um, and we're going to head down to the cottage now. Um, I forgot to mention, obviously, um, we stopped in Bala Lake on the way, um, just for an hour or two, just to have a quick ice cream, um, which is really nice. Um, and we didn't feel much of that, we were just too busy just having ice cream. So uh, yeah, we're heading to the cottage and uh, we'll catch you later.